First came voice control, where anyone in the house could talk to a smart digital assistant and get answers. Next came voice recognition, where the smart home experience could adapt based on who was asking for tasks or commands. When cameras started appearing in smart assistant devices, it's no surprise facial recognition came next. I'm Erin from TechGadgetsCanada.com for DigitalTrends.com, and facial recognition technology allows even more customization and personalization experiences on a smart home device. With Amazon's new Echo Show 15, this feature is called Visual ID. In this video, I'll take a look at what Visual ID is, how it works, and how to get it set up. An early heads up, if you end up liking this video and finding it helpful, to please hit that like button and do consider becoming a subscriber. Both those things help me keep making more videos that I hope everyone out there gets to watch, enjoy, and learn from. So what is Visual ID? This is Amazon's new-ish facial recognition service. With Visual ID in the Echo Show 15 here, the Echo Show can recognize you and deliver personalized calendar information, weather forecasts, alerts, or the latest news from your favorite sources. It also enables things like notes from you to your partner that may say, love you, have a good day at work. And when someone else in your household who is also enrolled in the Visual ID program comes close to the device, they can see the information that's relevant to them as well. So is Visual ID always on? Well, yes and no. You do need to set this type of recognition up. It's not enabled by default. Amazon promises that images of your face that are used to create your Visual ID profile are securely stored on your device and not in Amazon's cloud. Then, once you grant permission to use the Visual ID features, the camera is always on and always watching for you to deliver your concierge experiences. You can disable things temporarily by swiping the privacy shutter or permanently by permanently deleting your ID in settings, which we will touch on. So let's look at using Visual ID on something like Amazon's new Echo Show 15 here. To get this feature set up, here's what you need to do. And this setup information, by the way, will assume you've already installed your Echo Show 15, but skipped the Visual ID option, which it does offer when you first set up and initialize your device. There are two ways you can get Visual ID set up right now. You can ask a lady by saying, hey, a lady, learn, learn my, my face. face, or use the touch screen on your device. Swipe down from the top of the screen and choose settings. Then you'll select your profile and family. Next up, choose the family member you want to set Visual ID for. Tap on Set up Visual ID, then once you read through the disclaimer and enable permissions, the camera will scan your face from a few angles. In under a minute, you're ready. You can even add your children to Visual ID if you want. Children will be linked to an Amazon Kids profile and serve them only age-appropriate content when your child is recognized. If you no longer want to take part in Visual ID, by the way, or maybe you're selling or giving away your device, it's actually quite easy to delete your Visual ID. On the device, just swipe down from the top of the Echo Show, open Settings, open Your Profile and Family, then choose Delete Visual ID. So that is how to add or remove Visual ID on your Echo Show 15 to create a more personalized experience. If you want to read this topic or reference any of what I've talked about here, head over to digitaltrends.com this time, where we've got a full write-up. There you can ask any questions you have about this process. You can also post them here in comments below. Thanks so much for watching. I'm Erin. Until the next time, you can find me on either Twitter or Instagram. I'm at ErinLYYC. You can also always catch me on Facebook at facebook.com slash techgadgetscanada.